I have a few people coming over tonight, and I don't know about you, but I just love family and friends coming together, enjoying food, having a good time. So I decided to put together this baked brie. If you want a crowd pleaser, guys, you've got to try this. Came out absolutely incredible. So let me show you how to do this. So what you want to do first is get yourself an eight ounce brie wheel. And I'm just gonna set this on a baking sheet. And there's a rind on here and I always leave it on. And I'm using, like I said, the, the eight ounce brie wheel. If you want to use something bigger than simply double the recipe, it's up to you. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and slip this into a 350 degree Fahrenheit, 180 Celsius preheated oven for about 12 to 15 minutes. Well, the brie is baking. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already done so and stick around at the end of the video for our community time. While we're waiting for the brie, let's make that ever so delicious sauce. To do this, I'm gonna add a tablespoon of butter to a fairly small saucepan, followed by four tablespoons of honey. And you can also do two tablespoons of maple syrup and two tablespoons of honey if you want. I just like the old honey, honey. A quarter cup of packed sugar. A quarter teaspoon of one of my all-time favorites, some cinnamon. I just love this stuff. A pinch of nutmeg. It simply wouldn't be festive without nutmeg. Some chopped rosemary. Everybody doesn't use rosemary, but I just love it. It just adds that wonderful aromatic flavor. And last but not least, some orange zest. I just love the smell of oranges. Okay, pot over medium heat, and we'll just bring this to a light boil Well, we're stirring. Okay, and this is about what you want, guys. It's, it's becoming foamy and it's beginning to bubble, so you got that caramelization process starting. Just perfect. And just look at this. Wow. Now I'm going to add in a quarter cup of pecans, a quarter cup of dried cranberries, give this a fold together, and our sauce is done. And Oh wow, doesn't this look incredible? Just look at this, guys. And it smells absolutely delicious. Now let's get this over top of the brie while well, it's still runny and bubbly. and a little bit more orange zest over the top and you're good to go and of course guys this is perfect served up with a baguette and there you have it our friends our festive baked brie perfect for the holidays parties any occasion for that matter oh i can hardly wait to dig in okay time for the taste test so let's dig in and get some of that brie on Oh, just look at this. And of course we need some sauce and a few of the goodies. And I just have to show this again. Just look at this yummy goodness. Oh, I just can't believe it. Mmm. Absolutely unbelievable. I have to say, I cheated before and just had some baguette and some of the sauce, and it was good. But combine it with that creaminess of the brie, the sauce, mm, the pecans, the cranberries, it is just incredible. I mean, your friends and family are just going to go crazy over this. A must make. Hey guys, community time. Koki's a bit wild today, so he's playing with his Mr. Mr. Pig here. But anyway, just a few things I want to say. I hope everybody had a fantastic Thanksgiving. I always love Thanksgiving. I love Christmas and then January. Wow, everything goes down. I think I'm going to invent a new holiday. <clears throat> Excuse me, a new holiday for January. Um, also, we're thinking about bringing out some merchandise so you can buy Cook and Share t-shirts, um, a Cook and Share coffee mug, whatever you like, something like that. So let us know your, your thoughts about that. You know, it'll kind of flush up during the, 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 uh, the video merchandise. We are thinking about doing some live videos too. Not really cooking videos, but just kind of start off with a hangout video where you can ask a few questions. 
Um, you know, of course, it'll be pre-announced and all that. So let us know what you think of that idea. I'm kind of using my cheat sheet here. I'm also toying with the idea of Premiere. And what Premiere is, an hour before a video is released, you'll be notified. And subscribers only can watch the video. And we watch it together. You can comment. I reply back. And then after that, the video is actually released. Uh, let me know your thoughts on that. Also, pictures with this wonderful festive season coming up. If you have, you know, baking pics of your food, send them to webmaster at cookandshare.com or also you could send them to Facebook. We have a Facebook page or Instagram, whatever you, whatever you prefer, but we'd love to see your pictures and put them on the website. I think that's about all for now. So thanks for watching, guys. Again, have a wonderful Thanksgiving. Don't eat too much turkey. Stay safe, and we'll see you next time.